anyways, I wanted to talk to you guys about my orchid that I got for like $5 uh, at a grocery store. I got two of them. Here is the one. Here's one here. It's just chilling. Um, this wasn't there when I got it. Uh, I grew it and then it did have some flowers, but they expired. This one also had um, some flowers on it. And then eventually it did this thing. And I was like, what are you, are you confused? Cause leaves are supposed to grow at the bottom of the plant. So I looked it up and surprisingly, they said that when your orchid does that, it's having a baby. You guys, I'm having a baby, uh, orchid baby. And I gotta wait until it grows the roots, the aerial roots, like like this one here. This one uh, hanging out is a, a root. And so I gotta wait until this starts to grow some roots. Nothing yet. Uh, and then I can chop it off and plant it and I'll have a new orchid. You guys, it's so exciting. They say it's not very common um, for them to have babies. So I'm just special. Another thing I wanna to talk to you about, cause look, this is my notes to self. Orchid baby Christmas fern. Uh, something I figured out is that there are some evergreen ferns. So I was watching uh, this other YouTuber guy's uh, words. They go on camping adventures and one of the guys is very knowledgeable about plants and so he points out the different fungi and um, plants that are on the trail. And he pointed out in the snow there was this fern that was still alive and it was green and he called it a Christmas fern. And so, oh, my arm's getting tired, hang on. White balance is fantastic. Anyways, um, so what he did, uh, what he did was identify the plant. And so what I did was contact all of the local nurseries in town to see like, hey, do you have Christmas ferns or do you ever get Christmas ferns in stock? And uh, some, most, okay, most of them didn't reply. Um, and then one of them said, we used to have Christmas cactus, but we sold out of the last one yesterday. I responded, I'm not looking for cactus, I'm looking for ferns, but thank you anyways. <clears throat> so then I went and did some research of my own. So I went and I searched um, purchasing Christmas ferns online, something like that. And so I went to a couple different websites and they had them for like $13 or $9. And I was like, okay, that's not too bad. And like, I had some in my cart on the different websites, but I was still searching. And then I found this website, not sponsored, uh, called um, Direct Garden or Gardening. Anyways, I'll put it in the link down below. Um, and they had them for like $3. And so, um, did you lose your ball, ma'am? Hang on. All right, so I bought those because they were cheapest and um, they don't ship them until it is warm enough in your zone uh, to actually plant them in the ground. Children. So they won't be coming until like April, which is fine. But then I also, what else? I came with something else. Ma'am, I'm trying to film a video here. Don't look at me like that. It was creeping time and it's like a pinkish color. Anyways, I want to move the pave stones from where I redid them to around back of the remaining, the remaining tree, the tree that we're leaving up um, in the backyard uh, so that it kind of goes back, back there and it's shaded and so grass doesn't really grow too well back there anyways i wanted to have something pretty back there and i think it would look nice around the pavement stones the pavement stones puppy anyways 
So that's what I was thinking. Anyways, uh, total plus shipping was like $30 for eight Christmas ferns and six Creeping Time plants. So I recommend them. Yeah, that's my gardening update. <laughs> uh, <clears throat> it is negative seven outside. Real feel of negative 27. Uh, so I'm not going outside anytime soon. Uh, I will, I will be, uh, I won't be uh, gardening anytime soon, but it is always exciting to look for, look toward the future of spring. <sighs> Words are hard, you guys. Anyways, hope you're having a great weekend. It's Valentine's Day today. We're not doing anything special. <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna make some cookies for him uh in just a bit here that is my plan so all right have a great day and i will see you next time bye what is that what is that what kind of a wave is that <laughs>